Hi, this is Debbie again, back with Grandpa's Diatomaceous Earth. Remember, it's freshwater food grade, white. I've already did um, take the diatomaceous earth with bottled water and made a solution again, like I did it with my facial. But this time we're gonna use it on any type of flea bites, mosquito bites, mainly probably mosquito bites, ant bites that can get on anybody. Well, I have my granddaughter who's gonna help me out today. You can notice that the mosquitoes really love her and they've just kind of putting up her legs really bad, and she's been not with me for a while, so we're going to do the diatomaceous earth like we've done before many times. And um, you can see it, it's just kind of watery. It turns a little bit, look like mud. So this is how we apply it. I just put a little bit on my finger, and I rub it right onto that spot. You can see she has a really big one down here. I think the ankles are the most, because they love to wear these little flip-flops all over the place. And the best time to do this, we feel, is after you take a bath at night. You get up in the, uh, get out of the bath and put your jammies on. And then you put, just put this on and go to bed. Right, Tyler? Now, does that burn or sting or anything? No. No, good. So we just put it, you could almost, with her leg, I could just probably plaster the whole leg. It would probably really help. And it won't hurt being in the bedding or anything like that. It's very comfortable. It's almost like a talcum powder when it dries. It just kind of flakes off. And I want to show you something. Once it does dry, you can actually flake it off and it stays into pores. And that's how you apply it. And if you continually do this for probably a week, you'll see such a difference on her leg. And we're going to try to come back in about a week so you can see how it not only helps stop the itch, but it helps dry up and take that redness away so that um, it'll make her legs look beautiful again. So we'll be back in a few minutes and see how white they can turn. Hi, we're back. Uh, Tylee and me. Um, this is what it looks like once it's dried, just like the facial. And um, she can just go to bed with it like that and uh, it will flake off a little bit at a time. You can see I can just rub the extra off and what it'll do when she moves around in bed, it'll flake off. But what's nice, it seems to stay really on to, this was the large one by her ankle. She had one over here. You can see some of that come off. She might do that before she goes to bed, but I know she has little leggings that she wears when she goes to bed. But that is how it does. It's very soft and smooth. And she's going to be applying this for a week, and then we're going to come back and show you what her legs look like afterwards. And that's how easy it is. I just wanted to show you Tylee's legs. And just a few days from doing our process of doing them in the evening, her legs um, are getting so much better. So she doesn't have the itching. You can see where the, the big sores were at the ankle. They're, they're drying really nice. And so she's just going to keep the process going until they're all gone. So that's our update.